we are on Claire and Kelly is going to show us around. Absolutely. Thank nice you. to meet you. Nice to meet Welcome. you too. Thank you. Happy to show you the inside. Come follow me. Please. How's it going? Good and you? Awesome. Albert, our engineer. <laughs> Wonderful. Come on through to the galley. We'll introduce you to our chef, Adrian. I don't know if you've met Captain Eric as well. That's our chef. Oh, might say hello as well. Hello, he, Captain he, he Eric. the driver. <laughs> the driver. That's our engineer, Wonderful. Albert, uh, yeah. With Formula One racing experience. Yeah, Absolutely. This thing goes fast. <laughs> wait, wait, how fast is fast? How fast can we go? 35, 30, 28? Oh, no. We're going to 25. 25. Well, for the size, wonderful. Yeah, yeah. And you would be the chef. Yes, I am. Adrian, nice to meet you. Hi, Adrian. Nice. Welcome Single aboard. question, what's the meal that the guests usually enjoy the most? Um, you know, it's a safe bet. Everybody likes it. Yes, I mean, I, never, I haven't received any complaint yet, uh, so I try to always accommodate to what they like. Something you know? specific? Maybe something from the Bahamas? Maybe some specific way you do the snapper? or. Uh, um, well, no, it depends. I yeah, I try to use the, uh, local ingredients for sure. Um, but yeah, I mean, so fresh like ingredients and seasonings and, and lo local flavors for sure, mixed with the with the, um, other techniques from other countries. Yeah. You know. A very humble chef. Wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Food is phenomenal. We absolutely love it. Please do Sorry. say because his humbleness is kind of like you know like doing this service. His food is phenomenal. Delicious. And we Delicious. see my favorite coffee machine, Yura, which is are. probably like what makes the morning. Exactly, right? Makes uh, everything Yura good. is the best coffee machine ever, and you have the good one. Yeah. Please, let's yeah. move on. Yeah, absolutely. I'll have Come coffee later. Okay, sounds good. If I may. Yes, you will, of course. Absolutely. If you haven't had Yura coffee, you absolutely need to. There you go, absolutely. And I see a little bit classical style sailing. I wonder what the cabins look like. I'm, oh, I'm gonna. I have a feeling that I'm gonna feel like a, in a sailboat. Oh, maybe. Let, let's see. Let's see. It's a power boat. It's a motor. You probably should have went to our dining room for interior dining. Mhm. Mm yeah, full beam dining room. Interesting layout. And this is something that I'll have to film you. That you'll have to try out. These are amazing. I, I'm just looking at it. I like uh, movie theater. Mm -hmm. I'm a fan of art and history, so I'd actually like to see that picture. But there is a TV. Yeah. I'm wondering what's behind because here I see a historical picture of an event I cannot describe. Like it's an arrival and everybody's waiting. It looks like a regatta from like 1700s or some kind of military force coming in and being expected. Yeah, yeah exactly. And this okay. goes along with our theme that we are doing the Bahamas regatta and that's where we are dressed in the Bahamas oh, regatta. Oh, wonderful. Is our theme, is the mm -hmm. Bahamas regatta. It's coming up soon. So, wonderful chairs. chairs. Uh, they look like massage chairs as well. Oh, I see. I, I couldn't translate it in the video, so let's just uh, mention them. And uh, I would love to have one of those at home. Oh, yeah, you would. It's from the Lives of Mac. Fabulous. And I just cannot stop admiring the artworks in every single one of them. Yeah, like regatta and sailing and racing. And this is uh, some kind of a tr critical situation. First come, first served. Oh, I see. Where is it? Uh huh. Carry it. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Shalom. These little details, I just can't stop admiring them. Mm -hmm. I just call it classical style. Is there a, a different way to describe the style? I think classical is probably the best description. Mm -hmm. This is our twin room. This is the one that's different from any of the others. Mm -hmm. Greece? I'm looking at the pictures. I'm thinking Italy and Greece and different pictures. Uh, is this a Pullman bed? Yes, it is. All right, so we have like a bunk bed and or a twin 
whatever is preferred. Mm -hmm. So these are the twin. Every other bed in this mm -hmm. boat is king size. And mm -hmm. so it's just a difference in the room. So if you go on the port side, mm -hmm. you'll see a king size bed. So the little details. So actually, like real, like valued masterpieces on board. Nice. Mm -hmm. Actually works out the music with the style, you know, like a little bit Caribbean vibe, or I'm told Bahamas is not Caribbean, it's but not, uh, it's the Bahamian vibe exactly. Although mm -hmm. I have to say this is reggae, so it could be a little bit of yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. because we're doing the regatta, yeah. But it works out together with the style. I'm happy with that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's fight against the windmills for a bit, huh? Right, exactly. Yep. Even a dawn. Mm -hmm. Sancho Pancho. Mm -hmm. Magnificent. The little the details. Here as well, the sculpture on the other side. We have day heads on every level mm -hmm. in the lower guest room, so that's our main day head. Difference of styles, like the romantic sculptures mm -hmm. and then the variety of styles in the paintings, all fitted with the interior. Sure. This is the master, so we have a master study in. Well, here. it starts here. <laughs> so the computer is usually and here? Modern. Yes. 27 yes. Mac? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So you do see through the other side. I like that. I'm in the office and then the, you can see in the shower. That's, that, that's neat. Mm -hmm. Again, different kind of art. It's like stop working. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Wonderful. Just the little details. I cannot stop appreciating that. Like this jewelry box. Yes. I mean. Uh, and the orchids are they like yes they are they're real they're oh and they're, they're really like are. in full bloom my orchid just died i need to get new ones you know what the thing is they go dormant they don't die they just rest. i see all right i have 43 orchids in my tree at home right now well so yeah so like i see the new springs again. but exactly. i need to wait for it that's the thing is it takes oh and this will be, would be venison and mark square yeah, so, yeah. yeah. I believe so. So Italy, definitely the, the vibe Italian, and style yeah. and the paintings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd like to hear so much more about these. So like we mm -hmm. could spend the whole day just describing the the different pictures and the style. And I must say one thing that I appreciate: it's not broken up, that it's consistent. And uh, you know, like usually there are some disturbing elements to it, but here it's just, it just through flows. through the boat. Yeah. Nice. The umbrellas you can see that everything has been thought through and improved through the throughout improved, the years yeah. mm -hmm. would you like to see the bridge please bridge forward captain's cabin up there as well the and also there's plenty of room for i would be here for the docking and stuff to see the oh, action oh, absolutely it's a well, wonderful view 
Mm -hmm. Would you say uh, it's challenging to dock in the Bahamas, or uh, it's That's more? That's the thing we could definitely ask Eric mm -hmm. because he's the one who does the docking. I see. And he's modest. I mean, he's really, really good at it, but he'd say, eh, you know. Yeah, I, I've <laughs> noticed the chef as well. Like modesty is yeah, a thing on this yeah, boat. Yeah, and yeah, as absolutely. for the draft and uh, the limitations. Yeah, exactly. We're looking at just over seven feet, but because, yeah, which is great, right? Which, like, which is great. Mm -hmm. The Bahamas is shallower, but because. Eric and I have been doing this for well over 20 mm -hmm. years, and we've spent a lot of time in the Bahamas. Mm -hmm. We know exactly where we can go and get through. Eric knows all the spaces you know, to do. You know, so you're not limited by the size of the boat that you cannot get it, to, to it, place it, to a yeah. certain level, yeah. of course. So it's a big a boat. Point, mm -hmm. Exactly. You may not be able to always get as close to shore. Yeah, you cannot so get to the beach boats. directly, but of course. Uh, we've got of different course. beach mm -hmm. you know, runabouts that we can take to the beach as well. We get into wonderful places. Wonderful. And all the flags ready. Oh, absolutely. And, mm -hmm. ready. absolutely. Yep. On through, we do have more orchids that are getting ready to bloom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and our day head up here as well. So, one on every level. So, you don't have to rush anywhere. And then we do a little. Modest, very stylish, classical. I love it. I'm glad you like it. It's good. Mm -hmm. what we found is no one has walked on yet and said I hate it. Yeah. No really likes like that's the thing, the modesty where it's not in your face, right. it's the right. little details that get you. And comfortable. Yeah, like I, I'm looking at the sofa, like I mean it's so inviting. I, I want to just lay down and yeah. spend the rest oh, yeah. of the day. And it's, and Maybe it's have a, a little bit of whiskey, lay down, and just there chill. Wonderful. With the whiskey? With uh -huh. whiskey, with the mm -hmm. caramel whiskey, yeah, absolutely. Oh, this way everyone loves to dine out here. It's a wonderful place mm -hmm. to be. It really is. And a beautiful place to sit on, more places to relax and enjoy. So, is that a theme? This is the theme for What's our, the theme? The theme is the regatta. Oh, the, the regatta, regatta is the theme. Yeah, Bohemian, Bohemian regatta. regatta. And so we're wearing our hats for the Bohemian regatta. This is from Bahari, which is a local Bohemian designer. Mm -hmm. And the guy's shirts are also from the Bohemian designer. We have a little Wilbur in there, a little pig from Staniel Key. It's an Androsian print. Oh, and little pigs. The, yeah, and from the island of Andros, the Androsian print Andros. is really mm -hmm. big for the Bahamian regatta. The hats that are in there are local from the market, and they're for the scratch and rake, which is what they do during regatta, and those are regatta hats that everybody wears. They play a lot of the maracas and a lot of the drums during that. The maracas so are these things? These, that's what they call the maracas. And then they have the drums, and this is very big for the music that goes along with the regatta in the Bahamas, mm -hmm. which is coming up soon. It's not quite yet. And so the sailboats are authentic and also in Jersey. And the little glasses, like we could and go on into the details, yeah, but we would probably absolutely. spend the whole day. Exactly. Uh, just amazing the, the level to which it was elevated through little details over the years. You can see that this wasn't done like instantly, this was like constantly upgraded and it is. little and details it and, to be, mm -hmm. absolutely and then I'll be happy to show you up to the Chikisi deck as well this is a wonderful wonderful place to relax and hang out everyone really enjoys it here mm -hmm. you can be in the shade but you're still in the elements if the weather's so so you can still sit outside it's lovely yeah absolutely that's super soft I'm trying to find out where I put my drink <laughs> oh, oh well we have trays and so oh, okay so the tray comes on yeah, and, yeah. we have several options we either do a number of trays or Mm -hmm. I would put the hard placemats on there. So this is a very versatile area. We yeah, so you can like either like kick it in and have it as a bed exactly. and put exactly. trays on so you can have like 12 people on or three yeah. people on yeah, or absolutely. you can just chill with. Absolutely. Yeah, wonderful. It's just a fantastic space because you can mm -hmm. do so many things with it. Yeah. Sure. And yet yeah, it's a symbol. Yes, exactly. It's always in the simplicity. Mm -hmm. Inflatable slide from the top deck, all right. So the red down there is our inflatable slide, and that gets deployed over the side, and off we go. A huge barbecue. Huge barbecue. Another day head up here, so that if you want Oh, to up go, here a day head. Isn't that fantastic? Well, the, uh, don't I don't remember far. seeing one like that. There you go. So you don't have to go far. 
Yeah, especially from the jacuzzi, you know, you're in the jacuzzi, you have your champagne, you don't want to walk three three decks. And this also has an awning that goes over it as well, so you have the option if it's really sunny, you can... Awning over the jacuzzi on the sun? Yeah, not, it doesn't go all the way to the jacuzzi, because when you're in the jacuzzi, you pretty much want to be in the sun, but the awning goes a good long ways up to here, and so you can go either way with this one. Wonderful. Yeah, and the awning goes over the jacuzzi. I'm wondering if we've seen everything or... We've uh, seen everything except for the lower aft deck. If you'd like to head there, that's the last place to go. We can go through the outside and go down And maybe we can hear a little bit about maybe special places or special things that, uh, you know, you would uh, mention that uh, separate this boat from the rest. Oh, sure. Things that you can find here and well, nowhere else. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, what's really amazing mm -hmm. is that wide variety of experiences. For example, Eric and I have been doing this for well over 25 years. 25? And so we, yeah, I would say we're closer to 27 now, but who's counting? And so we've been in and out of the Caribbean, but we've also been a lot in and out of the Bahamas. So Eric and I know a lot of places, a lot of little out of the way places that over those years we've been Can you mention out. one for me? Sure. We, we will go to Moore's Island, we've gone to Long Island, we've gone to Cat Island, Grady Navajo. One place and why is it special? pristine beaches it is away from absolutely everything and everyone it is an island of your own okay Imagine. so why go there uh, it's remote go there uh, because it's remote the beaches are mm -hmm. incredible the snorkeling is beautiful the diving is beautiful and just being on the beach and enjoying the view wonderful of the water is mm -hmm. stunning. so a lot of experience that can suit uh, preferences of the charter right. more also, remote or want to see the places oh, that people want to go to have, yeah. you know, a chef who's trained internationally and so he's a specialist in all sorts of cuisines he knows a lot of nations he knows how to provision locally and provide local cuisine mm -hmm. wherever he goes and incorporate a lot of local mm -hmm. foods where he goes two of our first officer and our bosun are right here from the bahamas and we know the area very very well born and raised i would sum up the boat in two words humble brilliance that comes to mind That's you know very kind. <laughs> This can rise up and become another table. Oh, I see it down right. there, yeah. Oh.